Someday, this little guy could be a bomb-sniffing dog with a SWAT team. In fact, Thunder has now been training for almost three months. He's in Penn Vet's Working Dog Center, class of 2013, the center's first class. Along with seven classmates, he trains each day. They are all specially selected dogs, groomed from a very young age to work with police, military, or rescue search teams. Now, whether it's search and rescue or cadaver work or bombs or narcotics, um, we'll be able to imprint them with the scent, or whoever buys them will be able to imprint them with the scent. The puppies go through intense physical training and learn important skills. They need to be able to work effectively in difficult and sometimes dangerous situations. At first, the tasks are simple, like learning how to climb and balance, but their work quickly becomes more challenging. In this exercise, Kai searches for a hidden tug, a piece of leather with a recognizable scent. Local police help the working dog center by imprinting towels with different scents, such as cocaine or explosives. The dogs can then learn these scents. Police do use the real thing when imprinting a scent. The tug is hidden in the floor, under the drain cover. Kai will indicate that she's found it by scratching at the area. Good job! After they leave here, They'll probably attend, like a normal narcotics school be between 10 and 12 weeks. Explosives can go anywhere from 10 to 16 weeks. There's a lot of different sets that they have to be taught. This time, Kai must find a person who is hidden in a barrel at this construction site. Kai is trained to ignore these people standing here. In a rescue situation, she cannot be distracted by rescue workers. Here, Sox is looking for the leather tug in a warehouse room. She will sit to indicate that she's found it. The sit indicator is important for searches for explosives. Search dogs must not scratch at bombs for obvious reasons. These dogs train five days a week. Foster parents take the dogs home at night and then return them each morning for more school. The dogs train here for about a year.